Build as a stress reliever that's good for your body, mind, and spirit. It is advertised across the valley, and tonight we're learning the cuddle therapy industry is largely unregulated. So what happens if a therapist crosses the line? ABC 15 Zach Crenshaw with a warning for anyone thinking about giving it a try. If you search for cuddlers in the valley, you will find dozens of options on different websites, both men and women advertising their age, weight, sexual orientation, even if they have a passport. But no one is regulating who out there can say they're a professional cuddler. On her website, Suzanne Woodward says she's a certified professional cuddler, charging 80 an hour and telling potential clients, quote, something magical happens when a person is held. She discussed it with ABC 15 back in 2016. Just biochemically, you know, we, we need physical touch in our life. Recently, her physical touch came into question, a client alleging inappropriate sexual contact. The Arizona Republic reporting a female client filed a complaint back in May, saying Woodward's nipple was in her mouth for five minutes. The client asked Tempe police to investigate and filed a complaint with the Arizona Massage Therapy Board. Nothing illegal that occurred here. Woodward and her attorney, Flynn Carey, explained their side before the board a few weeks ago. She went to see uh, Dr. Woodward as a cuddle therapist. Specifically in her complaint, complainant says, I told her that it had always been my dream to be held naked by a woman. Police reached the same conclusion. Woodward was never arrested and still has her massage therapy license. We tried to talk to her at home and at her business. Both Woodward and her attorney never responded to calls, texts, or emails. The board ultimately concluded they do not regulate cuddling. We have no jurisdiction over this. That means if a line is crossed during the intimate business transaction, there's very little recourse for the victim, whether that's the client or the cuddler. Now, Woodward has hosted a number of cuddling parties at her home. Online, there appears to be one scheduled for this Sunday. Zach Crenshaw, ABC 15, Arizona.